to BB Kid News. I'm your host, Sarah, and we have Mr. Yogurt here on our program. Mr. Yogurt has been getting a lot of attention lately in Albany. Mr. Yogurt, thank you for coming today. Please tell us a little about yourself. Well, I like to take long walks in the park and play a lot of tennis. Tennis? You play tennis? Yeah, I play with a bunch of frozen yogurt friends of mine. They have a nice soft serve. Interesting. What do you think about the popularity you've been getting lately? Well, us yogurts have always been part of the vibrant growing culture. I am referring to the fact that a group of kids from Byron Birch and Elementary School are trying to make you the official state snack. Get out, really? You didn't know? Why else would we have you on this program? Oh, I thought this was my interview for People Magazine's 50 Most Beautiful People. No, that's with Barbara Walters. We are here today to talk about you possibly becoming the official state snack of New York. Why do you think you should have that honor? Uh, because I am dreamy? You mean creamy? No, dreamy. Because of other commitments, I was unable to star in Grey's Anatomy. Wouldn't you say it is because you are a healthy snack filled with vitamins and minerals and good bacteria that boosts your immune system? I do that? And that New York is the number one producer of yogurt in the United States? producing over 700 million pounds of yogurt a year. That would explain why I have so many cousins. And that the yogurt industry is crucial to the New York State economy, with 39 facilities across the state from Long Island to Buffalo. Really? And could it be because in the last five years, New York's yogurt plants have nearly tripled production? New York is now the fastest growing producer of yogurt. And even Governor of New York, Andrew Cuomo, declared New York State the yogurt capital of America. Wow.